Welcome to this old hit by Brother Kane. Um, I'm a real big fan of Damon Johnson. So if you're watching this, uh, leave me a little note. But uh, <laughs> this this song was um, probably their biggest hit, and and I wanted to uh, learn it, so I sat down, and um, we'll go over all the parts, including the lead. And um, boy, it's a really killer song. Got some great harmonica some great riffs in it and I think you'll really enjoy it. For this song everything is tuned down a half step so you're at E flat, A flat, D flat, so forth. So tune every string a half step down and you'll be in tune with the song. Alright to start out with we're gonna slide down the A string and then come into a power chord A and then what we're going to do on the third string, you want to let that A ring a little bit. So we're going to hit the second fret of the third string twice and pull off to open. Then we're going to hit a D chord, alright? So the next part, what we're going to do while that D is ringing out, we're going to hit the G string with the second fret here once to the open fourth, back to the third, twice, and then we're going to hit, pull our first, our middle finger off and hit the uh, C note on the third fret of the fifth string with a pull down. So we have this, let me hit the D chord, and then it starts over. You want to kind of let the chords ring out and mute some so you're hearing it. So there is a real technique to it. I'm sure he's got the guitars doubled in the studio version. But if you watch him live, he's playing it all right up here. So we'll do that four times and the next we're into the verse, all right? So for the verse, we're going to hit the A twice, but there's a pause after it. Then we move up to, um, we're referencing a C here. We're going to be playing on the uh, fourth and third string. You can catch a second if you want. And then to a D. So we have this. Then we're going to go back to our C, back to D twice, back to C, so we have this. Give it some vibrato, back to your A twice. Some people say he slides up, but he's singing. So while he's singing and playing, I don't see him sliding up. I just see him playing the C to D here. Next, we go into a C ninth form, okay? So we're gonna play this just like a G with your, uh, with the, uh, third fret of the uh, first and second string but we're going to start on the fifth at the third and the uh, fourth at the second we're going to hit five four three two and then into a D five four or I'm sorry four three two and then hit D twice so that takes you out of it all right so we have So that's the verse. Now coming out of the verse, only the first verse they go to a B and then a D. So all right. 
So that's like a, uh, it's a turnaround coming out of the verse and we're going towards the chorus. So okay, we're still at the first verse. We've done our B to D. Now we're gonna do a little turnaround that'll go A, D, and then C to A. And we hit that A twice. Okay, so we'll do that a total of three times. So let's go through that together. One, two, three, four. Then what he does is he's going to ride on the A for a little bit. And then he's going to hit from six on the fifth string to seven and then to the C chord that we're doing just on the uh, fourth and third string. Okay, so, so let's take it from the B into it. One, two, three, four. Chorus. Let me do the chorus kind of slow so you can see how it goes. So that chorus is real tricky because it's it's funky. It goes to an F, which really can throw you off. So we're going from A to D. And between the A to D, we're hitting a G. So we're hitting A power chord, then a G by basically hitting the open third and uh, fourth string. And then a chaka and then D, open G to F, and then our little lick. So again, at its speed. intro again okay so those are the chords and you can practice along with it and get the finesse that he's using it's it's a real technique watch him play this live there's some great videos hey the second verse the second verse will start out just like the first after we've done the intro we're gonna go <laughs> part of it and then when we come out of the C to D we're doing the intro okay he'll do that intro two times through okay and then they they don't do a, a B to D they jump right into chorus. Now the chorus, what they do is three times through. They're not going to go just twice and hold on the F. They'll do three of them and then hold on the F. Okay, so it'll go. Damon 
and starts his first lead. So you're just, after that um, second course, you're just hanging on the E for half of it. Okay, that's the rhythm underneath until they start the second part. So after the E... They're going to go into the chorus and they'll do a full, um, I think it's two measures. Alright, and so after they do that four times, they'll come into um, the B. And this is where Damon's coming out of the lead. to the chorus again and then the out um, so you'll be able to follow that so we'll go through the lead next okay here's the lead part at speed that's under the E <laughs> So what he's doing, he's sliding from 5 to 7, and then we're going to go 5 on the, that's on the 5th string, we're going to go 5 on the 4th to, back to 7 on the 5th, 5 on the 4th to 7th, and then we're going to bend it up, release to uh, 5, and then hit 7, 5 again. When we hit five, okay, we're going to hit it twice. So we have this. One, two, three, four. Now the next lick will go like this. What we're doing is bending up the third string at 14. Once we get it a full step, we're going to use our, um, I use my, uh, I use my ring finger and then pick. So you're alternating between finger and pick. As you release the bend. So you're going to release it to 12, pull off to 12, and then hit 14 on the um, fourth string. And then we go up to the um, third fret and just pull that down. Alright, that starts the, um, they go into the chorus part of the rhythm. Okay, the next section of the part, he throws on a Y and he's doing this. Alright, so what we're doing is we're bending 7 with a quick release to 5. And you hit the 5. And then 7, that's on the 3rd string, 7 on the 4. So we'll do that 3 times. Then we'll come back to five and then seven with a bend up and release just like we did. And then seven on the fourth to five on the third, seven five on the fourth. Now we're just going to roll our finger up and catch five on the fifth string, hammer into seven, and then catch five on the fourth. So all together we have this. One, two, three, Four. The next part of the lick will go like this. All 
Alright, so what we're doing is we're taking five on the second string and hammering in. This is the next part of the uh, lead. We still have the wah on. Alright, so what we're doing is we're going to hit five to eight twice. Then we stop and we're going to hit eight three times, seven three times, five three times to the third string and hit seven three times. Then we'll go to five and come back to seven on that third string with a bend up and release to five, catching seven on the fourth string. Back to five. And then we're going to bend and a release from 7 to 5 on that third. And then 7, 5, 7. So all together, 1, 2, 3. Then what we do is we're going to take that second string at the 8th fret, slide it up to 10. Hit it two more times after the slide for a total of three times on ten. Then we come to eight on the first, to ten, eight on the second, to nine on the third, and then eight to ten hammer on. So all together, one, two, three, four. Next lick will go like this. Alright, so what we're doing there is kind of a, we're going to bend the um, 19th fret on the 3rd string, hit 17 on the 1st string, and then 20 pull off to um, 17 on the 2nd string. We'll do that four times total. Then we're going to hit 17 again, and then hit 20 and bend that up. All right, and then we just kind of come back from 20 to 17. And then we're going to take um, 19 on the third string, give it a bend up and a release to 15. Then we're going to take 19, give it a bend up and a release to 17. The next lick will go like this. Alright, so what we're doing there is kind of a, we're going to bend the um, 19th fret on the third string. Hit 17 on the first string, and then 20 pull off to um, 17 on the first, second string. We'll do that four times total. Then we're going to hit 17 again, and then hit 20 and bend that up. All right, and then we just kind of come back from 20 to 17. And then we're going to take um, 19 on the third string, give it a bend up and a release to 15. Then we're going to take 19, give it a bend up and a release to 17. Back to, seven, back to 19, 17, and end up on um, 19 on the fourth. have this all together. One, two, three, four. All right, and then they come back into the uh, B. To D. So you know that part. Um, 
But that's pretty much the leads and licks in it. They'll go through another chorus, and um, that's a song. It's just a really, really kick-ass song. So I hope you guys enjoy, and uh, I'll post my notes if it'll help you play the leads and some of the uh, um, parts of it. So I hope you enjoy. 